What's good YouTube? So it's your boy Goose and since I'm not doing HXD videos anymore, I'm gonna do some other content as you guys can see. I'm not really doing HXD videos and today's video by like you can see a title and a thumbnail. Um, it's how do I get like 144 FPS um, averaging about that um, on low end PC. I mean really low end PC as you guys can see on the screen right now. Um, some clips and gameplay and also you can see my PC specs. It's really low end PC. So just let's get straight into the tutorial So the first thing is really most important if you have a GPU like Nvidia GPU go to Nvidia control panel on your desktop and Actually, I will show you guys some settings that you need to like have turn on on like optimized to boost your FPS and lower your ping So the first one is adjust image settings with preview uh, Once you go in here use my preference emphasizing um, It's gonna be on quality like that as you guys can see it looks like nice and then just slide all the way down and just click on the second option in the middle and click apply it's gonna apply and go into manage 3d settings and i'm not gonna f go like through all these settings but just copy my settings because it's the best for low end pc you can you can copy these if you're like on mid pc uh, medium uh, spec pc um so yeah i'm just gonna go through all of this and yeah guys just like that as you guys can see preferred refresh rate is the most like like best thing you can do is just turn on the highest available and it's gonna be like it's gonna use your hertz as most as it can and yeah going on the third setting is configure surround and physics um so processor is leave it on gpu whatever that you're using it's my school pc so i I have a GTX 660 and I don't know how do I manage to get 144 FPS in game as I have 144 Hz monitor, I mean, um, as you guys can see right here, um, not right here, here, yeah, just like that. So yeah, going on this, um, don't really need to, um, like anything, just use NVIDIA control color settings, I mean, it's going to be on this, so just simply do it on here, click apply. Um, it's gonna be better and you will have like more colorful game um, so yeah make sure you use the prefer refresh rate on the highest as your monitor can go and i suggest you guys to use uh, stretch resolution with, which is 1720 right by 1080 um, i really like it i've been playing for like a month right now yeah and then the new season and once i play rank i just like that this stretched and i hit most of my sniper shots so yeah um, adjust desktop color and settings digital vibrance right digital vibrance yeah right this right here it's gonna be on 50 for you but i don't really like how it's like dark and like gray and like looks the, looks the screen so i just up a bit and like 80 percent and it's more colorful and i i like like it just like yeah um, going into these doesn't really matter at all and I just desktop size and position keep it on full screen and perform scaling on display not on GPU I mean GPU is what you, you kind of like cause you delay so yeah and my dog is just walking around the house um, it's, it's 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 annoying okay so yeah, what I said guys is leave it this in, this in display and don't override the scaling mode set by games and programs um, which Fortnite like doesn't really like you don't really need to do if you're playing like 5M or Valorant then yeah you should leave this setting on on um, and then yeah close this and I know the second tip is how I don't know how dumb this sounds but go into your settings go to personalization right and go into colors um, not on color background right and background i know you're gonna have like a like a background like like i have right now right but switching into solid color and putting it on the black which is gonna give you a little bit of fps i know how dumb that sounds but um it was like proven um but like two seasons ago and someone posted on the twitter and said like it just literally boost your fps a bit like couple so yeah for low end pc couple fps might like 
be a lot. So yeah, moving on the third step is actually you should go in, I mean, just press double, uh, I mean double, not double. Um, Windows settings plus R at the same time and type app data and just go into local. Um, find Fortnite game, where is it? Fortnite game, save, config, Windows client, game user settings. Just double click it and make sure, right click, go to properties and make sure this read only is unchecked. And just, just double click and copy. I mean, these settings are pretty much the best optimized for the new season. Um, so yeah, motion blur you don't need. Show grass is false. Um, show FPS, I don't really like, need to know like how many FPS I'm getting. I know I'm getting like 144 on average, 120. Um, which I'm really happy for this PC that I'm getting these type of FPS. Um, and yeah, comment what GPU do you have in the comments down below. And yeah, guys, frame rate limit, um, 144, as I have a 144 hertz monitor. And some of pros suggest you like to put one um, above your monitor refresh rate, um, but I don't really like that. And I tested it out and it's really working for me as I have a low-end PC. As I said, I'm going down a little bit display gamma i don't know it's like everyone says that you should like leave it on one point like and then like six zeros right like this but i don't really like it i don't know why but it just keeps switching automatically for me like on 2.2 .2 and like some shit like zeros i don't really change this because it just fucks my um game settings so yeah um scrolling down you don't really need anything um but here yeah, like just like that file save um you could close and don't check read only and yeah um the last thing is going and typing graphics settings and you have fortnite on high performance if you do like um you just press save and you have to have on high performance and how do you like browse this it literally says go to like your disk then program files epic games fortnite fortnite game binaries windows 64 fortnite client windows 64 shipping .exe. right here it says the tutorial so um, yeah you just literally like go right here on this pc local disk c um as it says go to program files then find epic games um go to fortnite fortnite game and binaries windows 64 and then just find this right here and then click add and it should add like this and go to options and change this from like power saving or like let windows decide to high performance and that's it that's how you're gonna get most of your fps so yeah that was quick tips i hope you like liked it subscribe if you did and if you want my cursor as you guys can see this red thing right here this cross um don't, it's not like cross, but it's like a red thing right here. Um, go watch my YouTube video, which is gonna be like in the cards, like um, above this. That I said, like in the right corner corner um, of the screen. And yeah, guys, subscribe, like the video, and I'll upload more bangers. See ya.